In this bottle is Tony the Tiger. I got him out of a cereal box when I was seven years old and he's lived with me ever since. Watch what happens when I squeeze the bottle. Now, of course, tigers are well known for their swimming ability, but that's not what's happening here. Watch again. Do you think you have an idea of what's going on? Let's swap it out for a visible version of the same experiment. So as I squeeze the bottle, watch what happens to the dropper inside. So do you think you have an idea of what's happening here? This is Boyle's Law, the relationship between volume and pressure. And as I squeeze the bottle, the volume goes down, but the pressure goes up, squirting water into the dropper, changing its density and causing it to sink. When I release the bottle, the volume goes up, but the pressure goes down and the water squirts out of the dropper and it, its density changes and it rises back to the top. It's the same thing that was happening with Tony. He has a hole drilled in his feet. And when I squeeze the bottle, the volume is going down. So the increased pressure squirting water up into Tony, changing his density, he sinks to the bottom. When I let go of the bottle, the volume goes back up, but the pressure goes down and Tony swims back to the top. This is Boyle's Law.